Morning. Do you think today is gonna be the day? Maybe. Maybe. The call. Oh yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> the day. It must be today. <laughs> I hope so. I absolutely hope so because so far it's been an absolute struggle. So first of all, I had of course to wait for my residence permit papers to, to register myself. Uh, for that, submit like pension fund, go to the police, to a city hall, to all these things. And eventually when I had everything on that uh, regard on, uh, uh, on uh, when was it, on, uh, on Friday, uh, we uh, went to the MOT and we said, so I have all of this, I want to register the car, uh, I have my like uh, creation ID, uh, or actually paper that confirms that I had, a, I am going to receive my creation ID. So I went to MOT and the lady there says like, yeah, but how long are you going to stay? I don't know if this paper is real or not. I need to call the police to verify that it's real. <laughs> but you are the governmental institution. You are the police kind of, but uh, yeah. So she called them and they're closed at three and it was already five o'clock. So we had to wait another weekend. So hopefully today everything will be ready. Unless they're gonna ask for my great grandfather's birth certificate and probably blood type of his dog or something to confirm that I'm like, ah, but we'll see. Is it always this difficult in Croatia? Mm, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, the most exciting traffic jam because we're going to the Gulf. We're actually going to work, but this is something I've been waiting for a whole month already by now. See if it starts. Reheat it, all good. No, 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 no. Well, that's a bummer. Wonderful. <laughs> I'll never get, be able to register this car. Oh. Morning. Morning. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. We'll definitely say yes to that. Thank you. Okay, I'm on my way to the vehicle assembly to see if they have a, like a battery starter. But one of the great things about working at Rimats is that three days a week we get fresh fruit. Yum. I love your wheels. Yeah, yeah. They're literally okay. Yeah. I usually don't have plugger like this, but now I do. That's fine. See the rocket bunny kit? Oh wow, yeah, it actually is. Second. You're gonna put it on E46 or what? No, it's uh, <laughs> E30. <laughs> yes, bro. No, uh, what? Uh, uh, uh. These are good. It's uh, cables from the company and some kind of... Cool, so we're gonna have ex so they're, they're work. They're extra much power. Yeah. Good. If it can start the C2, it can start the Gulf. It will, for sure. <laughs> And there we go again. Well, not again, it's the first time, but still. Uh, is the battery in the front or in the back in the Gulf? Danger poison. Yep, lead poisoning, watch out. TDI gives life to TDI. Oh, your battery is not poisonous. Wee! <laughs> now let's go put, hopefully go through MOT and put the car on plates. Cannot believe that it's finally happening. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you, bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I think I'm gonna cry now. <laughs> you have no idea how uh, all the things that I had to go through. I mean, even this morning when I brought the car here to MOT, uh, they they wanted to like to start registering it, and they're like, "Oh yeah, we cannot find your tax ID number in the system." So someone at the tax registration office forgot to put my system uh, number actually in the system after giving me the paper. It's but we have it, we have it, we have it, we have it. Okay, I gotta uh, run to like work now, but it's just like literally behind this building.
uh, so I'll probably talk to you later about this whole thing. But oh my god, I got it! And by the way, Croatia offers a uh, possibility to have a uh, custom plate. So I have requested a custom plate um, and I'm uh, very excited for it. They're gonna run it with the police, see if it's like, if it's available and if it's not like offensive or whatnot. But yes, finally, finally, finally. Woo! I love the blue thingies, highlight, backlight, something, all the lights, everything. My God. So, a fast forward to half past 11, almost midnight. My dear colleague Marta is still working, as some other people in the company. That's how ambitious everyone is. Um, yeah, let's go for a ride, shall we? <laughs> I hope the car will start this time, but I'm pretty sure it will. Let it glow, let it glow. Yeah! Immediate start and my favorite blue background backlight. So what should I say? I really well first of all welcome on board <laughs> of the tractor. Yes uh, Second of all, I wanted Not only put the winter wheels on but that's something I will have to do tomorrow Probably at some point because I already wasted much of my work time today by registering the car But finally we got it perfect uh, on top of that, I really wanted to do a highway run because uh, when I took the car out for a test drive I didn't do any any highway runs and I really want to see how the car performs on high speeds because after all We are going to do some track driving with it at some point um, But also lots of long distance driving and I want to see how it feels but in general you cannot see much So maybe I will not even use this fragment because it's will be unusable. Maybe I'll just use, use some uh, daytime driving with it um, But so far I've been loving this car absolutely. You can probably not hear anything except for the the winter wheels in the back floating around. Um, and there's something in the in the door or something, or maybe my backpack. Yeah, it seems to be gone. Perfect. So no weird noises from the car. I'm happy. Let's not jinx it. But uh, I do want to do some sound mods. Not only put different stereo in, like I told you, but actually also. Oh, let's slow down here. And and does this mean that we get a chance to do a uh, traffic light pull? I mean, we can. We could do pull. I mean, it's uh, and it's not illegal to accelerate fast. It's just illegal to exceed the maximum speed limit. So I mean, we could. We could do pull. I mean, the car is like not. The car is cold though, so I don't think I should do anything crazy. But. Ooh, traction issues already. <laughs> wow. Well, the traction issues will be solved because actually, uh, as I'm on my way home, the first thing I'm gonna do is uh, pay for the gearbox and LSD and single mass flywheel. So this is going to be the first mod. Uh, there's already a lot of other modifications planned and uh, ordered. Uh, but this is, will be actually one of the first ones, very important ones, because it will uh, actually also reduce the fuel consumption for my long distance trips. And also the, the five speed gearbox, the stock ones can be uh, even break down on the highway from the stock horsepower I heard, so better be safe than sorry. Ah, on top, what should I say? Uh, important notice, I was supposed to be going to the Nürburgring with this car this weekend, but the Audi video shoot got cancelled, thereby I will be just flying to the Nürburgring because it will be more convenient and easier to just fly there and uh, do my thing. So there will be still Nürburgring content coming uh, end of the week and hopefully some Rimac content as well that will be approved. Taking the curbstones here, well we're not at the Nürburgring but I mean bad habits. Uh, another thing that I notice is that the water temperature does not really go up. This is something I remember from George's car that uh, it takes like forever to warm up because it's a diesel. So that could be like a pain in the winter. So the only thing that I'm missing actually in this car in terms of comfort are actually heated seats. Everything else is actually is good and perfect. I like it. Ooh, traction control light. <laughs> Better be careful not to induce any torque steer and not end up in the wall. <laughs> Very easy to induce wheel spin on this car. Wheel spin? Did I say that? Yeah, I said that. Overall, 
again, I'm very happy that I finally got this car on plates. And the very important notice I gotta make is that everyone, all, all of the people, especially the lady at the MOT desk at the registration office was very, very helpful and very apologetic that the system is not that user-friendly, so to say, for either foreigners or just like Croatians in general. Um, but we are here, so we can start modding, just waiting on the approval of a custom license plate. Um, and then that will be like one of the fancy mods on the car. Uh, you can maybe like comment and a guess and the best guess I don't know we haven't done any giveaway ever since the best guess wins I don't know should we do a Rimac giveaway should not be oh yeah you should give away the Rimac C2 yeah if only I had the money for uh, to buy one for a giveaway um, maybe mug or something yeah yeah let's do a mug giveaway so uh, uh, what license plate is it going to be? So let me know. Ooh. Traction control is not that really. I think it doesn't work in the first gear, but it starts kicking in afterwards. It's like not boost by gear, but traction control by gear. But you can at least turn it off and like in the sub seven up. So it'll be interesting. I'm very excited to do some laps with this car. It's. Uh, I think it has a lot of potential, especially with all the mods that we have planned for it. Oh, we need to go straight here because we're going straight. Uh, oh, can we do? Can we do tunnel? Tunnel run? That's some weird noise. Ooh, hear the turbo. The turbo whistle. <laughs> and now the guy pulls over next to me. He's like, "What the hell are you doing, dude? It's just me playing with my new car, bro. Don't get run over by a bus. Whoa, that's close." <laughs> and one more. <laughs> I'm like a kid. Actually quite decent pull. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's like any slower than sub 7 up. But another thing I want to mention is does the light turn on? Oh, weird. Yeah, there we go. Here. The car is going perfectly straight. So, I'm happy with that. On slow speeds though, I mean, that's why I wanted to do, see what it does on the highway. But it, it doesn't do any pulls. That's something I tested already when I bought the car. So, another comment by the way. A lot of people have said, oh my god, you paid 3000 euros for it, but like in UK or something you can get one for 800. Yeah, you can get a Golf 4 TDI for 800 euros, but it's going to be first gen, so pre-facelift, with lots of kilometers on the clock, zero options, nothing. So um, I think with what I have, I'm pretty happy with it, and it's going to be a very solid base for modifications, yes. Oh, wait, actually, I want to go this way, because in my street, I don't think I'm gonna find any parking. This is, by the way, my neighborhood, but you've seen already some on the videos previously. Where the hood, where the hood, where the hood at? Okay, will I find any parking spot here? That will do. I probably have a funny mark on my head now uh, from the GoPro. But uh, anyhow, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, it was a mixture of everything, but a very important milestone. We got the car on plates. Let me know what you think that the license plate is going to be. Um, and I don't know, let me know something. Should we do a q and I think we should do a QA. and a Ask me a question about something, anything you want, and uh, I'll post the QA and a up. Um, and see you guys in, I don't know if there's going to be tomorrow a video at this point, but uh, later when I'm back at the ring, there's going to be a lot of content. So uh, looking forward to that and see you then. Thanks for watching. Bye. This should be a food shot, but I forgot to film the pizza we had with Marta. Hmm. Next time, maybe. Yeah. Bye.